Hello and welcome to my second um, installment of my sort of TK Hammer tutorials. In this second tutorial I am planning to teach you how to use the carb tool and how to make a basic room with light that you can walk around in with your player in Counter Strike Source. Okay, let's get started. What I want you to do, I want you to make a 384 by 384, 384 by 384, and on the top view. Then on the side view, I want you to make a 192 by 192, no, not 192 by 192, 192 by 384, sorry. Okay, as you can see right there. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Okay. <laughs> And then you want to press enter to create your block as I showed you in the first tutorial and you get the camera tool which is that one there and select on the top view and drag across and then in the 3D view you'll be able to see that you now have it in there okay now what I'm going to do I'm going to click on this which is your um, your texture button and now we're going to choose for a a rock texture no not a rock texture we want a concrete so type con just for a simple and we want this one here concrete ceiling whatever that's called double click then to apply the texture that you want, you simply right click on the face that you want and then I'm just going to undo it. Okay, but I'm going to texturize it later, but first I want to show you a neat little trick to make a really fast, simple room. Okay, what you do, you either press Control H, okay, and you bring it up with this, okay, or you press, or you go up to Tools, whoops, I need to select it first using your select tool. Go to tools, make hollow. Okay, and as you can see, it's like that. Okay, then you click OK. And now if you go on your camera tool and press W, make it go forwards and S to go back and so on, you'll see that it's now hollow. So let's start texturizing. Let's get on our texture tool. And well now we have our concrete. Okay, move this other way. I want this and this to be concrete. So I basically right clicked on that and right clicked on this. This and this. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Sorry, I like scribbling. <laughs> okay. And as you can see, it's nice, okay. Right. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to make it so there's a little slope in your map and there's a higher platform to it. So we're going to zoom in by scrolling or by getting your zoom button and then zooming in okay I'm gonna click this button here which makes more squares as you can see and less squares with this one okay the one on the left makes small squares the one with the minus no the one with the minus makes more squares and the one with the plus makes less squares okay so we want to click on the one with the minus to make more squares Right, now we're going to go, um, still with the concrete, we're going to make a block like this, and make it so it's inside your room, by using these um, grab holsters here, and then click enter. Now you're probably thinking how on earth are you going to get up there? Well I'm going to teach you two ways, I'm going to teach you stairs and ramp. So what we're going to do? make it separate parts I'm going to go with the carve tool this one right here that one there that one and then carve right down the middle now you don't want it red because if it's red it's going to delete that block it's going to delete that half of the block you want to keep clicking on it until it comes white as you can see then you click enter now you can see on this screen they're two different um, blocks. So we're going to click on this one with the carve tool. Go on the front view or whatever view you have it on. Then click on there. Then click to there. 
but this time you want to say this bit's red so that bit gets deleted and now as you can see it's a nice round like this okay now we're going to do the stairs we're going to do the same ramp thing as you can see as I did last time but it's going to be a bit different we're gonna we're not gonna make it as ramped as the other one so we're gonna click on there then we're gonna make a block like this actually I think that's too big so I'm gonna make um more little squares and size it down I'm gonna click enter now to copy and paste it without going up to edit and copy and paste you hold down shift and drag it and as you can see there are now two so you keep doing that okay the select more than one object at a time you hold down cell control sorry and click on your objects as you can see and it will select them all now I'm going to make it so it's less laggy by going from there and cutting the underside off so that's the side that you're not seeing and as you can see it's a stair and a ramp now you won't be able to move around in it so what we're going to do we're going to make a spawn point and then to turn them around you click on them on the 2d view your top view then then hold on to one of these grab holsters here and then drag it round and as you can see it turns okay now we're going to click another and make another entity by clicking on the entity tool and clicking on the 3D view. Right clicking on the 2D view or double clicking on the 3D view and then and then typing in in this here light and then you click apply. Okay. Then click cancel, drag it up. It's already in the middle, I believe. There we go. And this map will be perfectly fine now to play. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and run the map. Hold on. First off, I need to save it. So I'm going to call it small. Whoops. Small. Wrong button, sorry. Small room. Make sure there's no spaces in it because otherwise your map won't work. If you want spaces, you press shift and that button there basically but I can't remember what it's called but you press it <laughs> right small whoops I want the other L L okay save now you can run the map you, you're going to want to keep these all selected okay um, if you want to run the game afterwards which I don't um, if you don't want to run it and you click that you click that little box right there so it's ticked so it won't run if you want it to run straight after you compiled the map you uncheck it okay okay just gonna wait for it to finish there we go finished right, I just compiled the map I'm gonna try to find it now um where is it come on let me find it uh, there it is okay and now I'll just load, hurry up. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna die of boredom. Here we go. Okay. Terrace Forces, Arctic Avengers. Okay, right, as you can see we've got a nice little light in here. And, hey look, there's our um, stairs and our ramp. That's pretty cool, isn't it? It's fun to go up and down though, I must say it's pretty fun. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, anyway, um, my third tutorial would be on skyboxes. It would, it would teach you how to make skyboxes in your map. And um, you will be able to learn how to use light environment. Okay, that's the end of this tutorial. Um, I hope you had fun watching it. Goodbye.